Why is the impossible so difficult? Ever thought about that? Well, the impossible is difficult for three reasons. One, we can't mentally see the impossible. It was impossible for a Chinese man to make in the NBA after Jeremy Lin. The in Whoa, the impossible is merely difficult. And now I'm going to give a presentation with the blue screen of death. <laughs> now, everybody wants to make money, right? Everybody loves to be rich. Let's do a little thought experiment. How to make the impossible possible. If I'm going to tell you you're going to start a company year one, you're going to make $24. In the end of the 40 years, you're going to make $5 billion. You're going to tell me, Roger, I'm the Warren Buffett. I can't do it. I'm going to tell you, neither can Warren Buffett. I'm going to tell you a story about a man who has harnessed the power to overcome the impossible to do justice. His name is Muhammad Yunus. He's a Nobel laureate. He created an amazing system that helps 3.5 million people get out of poverty in 40 years using only $24. That's the combined population of Taipei and Kaohsiung together. Now, imagine that's your mission. What would you do? Well, you harness the amazing power of social forces, environmental alteration, and technology. With these three forces, you can do anything. And I'm going to prove this to you. He used the power of social pressure to help people overcome poverty as a condition. They start to become entrepreneurs. He used technology to help people track how they're spending. And he used environmental factor to make poverty a condition to be ashamed of and to get out quickly. Because of this, he has helped 3.5 million people out of poverty. By 2035, he will have eliminated poverty as a human condition in this world. Now, that's impossible. I'm going to share my own plan. I've been on a diet for 20 years, and none of my plans survived the contact with chocolate. To make myself lose weight, this is my impossible goal. In 2013, I will run the Toroko Marathon. That's 42 miles of traveling, folks, from here to Zhongli, and about two bottles of aspirin. My first cheat, I told all my friends I'm going to run the marathon, so these bastards, when they go out to eat, refuse to let me have meat, butter, beer. Okay, so my social pressure is forcing me to have good habit. Second, because I know when I'm at home at night, I eat massively, I sew my refrigerator so I can't eat at night. I don't have to have willpower, I just don't have a fridge so I can't eat. Now, if I can move that 7-Eleven from my downstairs to somewhere else, I'm go. <laughs> Third, technology. My good friend Roy is helping me lose weight. Every week we take picture of our scale, we post it on Facebook, everybody sees it, we use technology as an accelerator so everybody in my life knows how much I'm weighing and how much to stop me. <laughs> it was on the slide. So in two months, I have lost 14 kilo kilograms. Well, 13 and a half. But this is how people overcome the impossible. First, let me tell you two people and two organizations. First person wants to put a PC in every home, in every office. Second person wants to manipulate the US government with only a million dollars. Two organizations. First one wants to sell every book ever printed in any language in 60 seconds. And the last one wants to empower the young people of the world. Now, these are impossible goals when they first stated, but you all agree, they're reality now. So to start your very first impossible dream, set an impossible goal. It has to be a massive goal for you to focus your energy and for you to start right away. So visualize that impossible goal. Second step, set your cheat, because you have to think outside the box. You have to cheat yourself. Sell your fridge, sell your TV, sell your boyfriend, whatever. Social pressure, environmental factor, and technology. These three forces will keep you on track and help you accelerate your dream. Lastly, test your result. This is a scientific progress. You will combine different strategies together to get the right result. Find the one that's effective, efficient, and most of all, entertaining. Because if you can do this, you can come up on stage next year and give the talk. Every body has the power to make an impossible dream come true. I give you permission, go ahead, Go make the impossible. I'm not going to tell anybody about it. So go ahead. Go and change the world. It's a lot of fun. And lastly, I'm Roger Du. I'm a professional speaker, professional trainer, and a writer. I'll be back there accepting free drinks. And to all the ladies in the house, 
I am the man your, your grandmother warned you about. Thank you very much.